Hey, welcome back. So, this episode we're going to be, um, actually trying to take this thing to the moon and seeing how it goes. Uh, we have Jeb, we have Bill, and we could use another. Stelbury. There we go. Stelbury, you get to go as well. I'm just trying to think if I've missed anything here. I mean, we could stick some science experiments on. That actually might not be a bad idea. Uh, if I can find a smallish one of these resource scanners. And then we just add a couple of science experiments. Science experiments to do science. Because science. Okay. Let's see how. Oh, I did forget something. The uh, stabilization towers. They are important. Uh, so, anyway, let's see if this goes terribly or not. Here we go. Okay. So, I don't think I need full throttle on the, uh, with the boosters and the main sail. I don't think I need the main sail at full throttle. So, SAS shouldn't turn on the RCS, because it's going to do no good within the shroud. And I want to save that for the moon landing anyway. So, let's see. Um, three, two, one, go! Okay, maybe I do need a little more. A little more power. This thing is heavy. This thing is really heavy. Okay. The solid fuel engines are having a really tough time with this. Uh... Can we start our turn? Our orbital turn without flipping this thing upside down? Oh, the solid fuel is almost out, and we're only up to, like, 8,000. Well, almost out. I mean, there's a third of it left, but it's disappearing fast. Uh... Yeah. This is... ...working out well. Okay. That is not an example of it working out well. Uh, okay, can we get rid of the... Uh, the unimportant stuff. Okay, and we need to go prograde. And hopefully we can fix the small... A small problem we had there. Okay. Let's start burning. Okay. You need to 
turn this direction. I mean, it would have been nice if I could have turned more while ascending, but the rocket was kind of overly heavy for that. Anyway, we should be pretty well off for now. I'm actually going to uh, shut down the engine until we get a little bit higher up. And let's quick save. Just in case something goes horribly wrong. We don't have to start all over. Uh, okay, probably should have uh, done this before I accelerated time to get up here. Uh, let's Okay. Okay. A uh, node, node reached. Burn. Just burn. There's one thing going for us, and that's that this small craft isn't actually that heavy. And so, it's easier to get going. <laughs> okay. We are gonna hit it. Oh, and we ran out of fuel just as we reached it, so that was kind of good timing. I mean, I was hoping to use this engine to actually get us to the moon, but, you know. It's all good. Okay, shroud be gone and jettison that. We don't actually have a ton of fuel. This might actually be unintentionally a one-way trap. Anyway, let's uh, set Moon as target. So, I think the moon's heading this way. I don't remember what exactly... Okay. Let's actually... Uh, we close that a little bit. Yes, we can. And we will actually get in the moon's gravitational influence with that. So, all we really need to do is it's get out there. And once we get out there, we'll be able to actually adjust our lunar orbit. Okay, so turn towards the maneuver node, and then we accelerate time, because it's going to be 30 minutes before we actually reach the node. 
and that would be 30 real-time minutes. So, I'm not going to wait for that. Okay, let's see. Hey, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Oh, there's some debris. That's the stuff we ejected once we got up. Okay, we got two minutes left. Go wait until we've got like 20 seconds. Okay. Okay, now we prepare. For the burn. Five, four, three, two, one, burn. Oh, burn. Okay. Yeah, we might not even be able to land on the moon with this. Because we're going to be at less than half fuel. We're actually probably going to run out of fuel. Uh. Oh yeah, it's definitely going to be a one-way trip regardless. Let's actually get out there, though. Moon encounter approaching. Right, the Outrider is still out there. Okay. Uh. Well. Uh. Click properly, and then. Can we reduce. Our orbital size? Oh, no, no. That's wrong. That isn't where it's supposed to be. Okay. No, that's the, uh... We're going to do this. And that's gonna need to be okay. Let's adjust this a little bit. Okay, we're going to be reaching the node in five minutes. Okay. Play 10, 9, 8, 7. Oh, it should have just did a maneuver node. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, burn. Oh, we're Ryan Gaffield. Oh, we're Ryan Gaffield. That worked. Okay, let's revert flight to vehicle assembly. Okay, so... <clears throat> Clearly, that didn't work out. I think the problem might be actually... Oh, no, no. Undo. Uh, 
they might just not have enough boosters. Oh, whoa. Okay, no, undo. No. Now. What are you doing? Uh. Okay. I'll. Maybe put the, uh. Fins on the boosters. That might make more sense. So, I mean, that should be the only thing we need, because if we have all those boosters, we should be able to get up on the first engine and then use the second engine to actually get out to the moon. And things should work out better. I think. I think. Let's go. <clears throat> Whoa, okay. Hello, camera. Uh, SAS on. Engine at full throttle. Uh. Let's. Let's go. That is loud. Okay, let's start. Maybe a little bit of an orbital turn. Okay, cut down on the main engine power. This is actually working kind of well. <laughs> okay. Now can we get rid of those without hitting anything? Thank you. Okay, we should be okay now to turn. Because we're almost out of the atmosphere. Okay, and we actually hit 200,000 with that. And we still got like a quarter, a fifth of a tank left in the first stage. So this is already working much better. But let's just set up a maneuver node. Increase the uh, hang on. Uh Set up a maneuver node, increase the orbital size, or rather make an orbit, period. Let's actually put it in between the two other orbits. Actually, no. 
we're going to make it a little bit further out. So we don't accidentally hit anything, which the chance is small, but I don't want there to be any chance. Okay, we'll hit the maneuver node in T minus 2 minutes and 56 seconds. Okay, let's sweet speed this up a little bit. Okay. And burn. And that should work out, hopefully. If we run out of fuel, I can just quickly go to the other engine. Okay. That was a firework show. But all that stuff should fall back down because it didn't actually make it into orbit with us. Anyway, uh, already a uh, half tank, but we are officially in orbit. Uh, that actually, no, we are not officially in orbit. Never mind. That's odd. Uh, can we get officially in orbit, please? Yes, thank you. Ah, uh, where is the moon is there? Okay, set as target. Stay on target. Uh, okay, don't need to put out quite that much. Um... Yeah, target position at closest approach isn't ideal yet. So I'm thinking we expand the orbit a little more and that should be good. Estimate burn three seconds. Okay. <laughs> Node in 22 minutes. So let's actually accelerate time. Five, four, three, let's start slowing that down. Uh, uh, one. Okay, 30 seconds. Let's actually get turned properly oriented towards the maneuver node and then let's go okay the 
Actually, the estimated burn time went up. That's odd. Yeah, I thought three seconds was kind of a, uh, a very short amount of time. Okay. We still have a little bit of fuel in this rocket, even. So let's head out here. Whoa. Okay. A uh, warp here. Here comes the moon. Okay. Let's get up to the moon encounter. And here we go. <clears throat> so let's put a maneuver node down. Let's shrink that orbit up. And face maneuver node and get ready to burn for eight seconds. Um. We got one minute left. Ten seconds. <laughs> Estimated burn, 31 years. Yeah. Can we, uh... Get rid of that rocket. And start our new one burning. Okay, now that's done, so let's set up a new node to actually get us into an orbit. Face maneuver node and... Accelerate time. Actually, I'm going to like the game do it automatically. And we are pretty close to the time to burn. Okay, okay, I missed, missed the time a little bit, but that's okay. We are orbiting the moon now. And so we're going to add a maneuver node up here and actually get down the moon's surface. Uh, there we go. We are now going to intersect the moon. Okay, warp here.
Hang on. Actually. Why can I not go back to the focus? There we go. Okay, we got one hour until we reach the node. Well, two hours. Uh, let's accelerate time a little bit. Okay. Okay, 10 seconds. Burn. Okay, it, uh, let's have a little bit of a lower periapsis. And here we go. We are going to land on the moon. Let's actually warp here. Warp a little bit further on. A little bit further. Okay. So we need... Uh, we need to face our butt towards the ground. And we need the gear out. Landing gear down. Okay. Is the landing gear doesn't look right. Okay. I may have put that on wrong. Uh let's turn on the lights. And we're actually getting ever closer to the surface. So let's... Wow, it is dark. <laughs> you can't really make out much of anything. Except, you know the moon surface. So anyway, let's start burning a little bit. Because we want to slow down a ton. Okay. Let's keep slowing down. Okay. This is nerve-wracking, and probably the most dangerous part of this mission second to the launch. <laughs> okay. RCS on. Okay.
Yeah, we're definitely going to need the uh the main molt the main engine for this. Okay. Come on. Balance out a little bit. Okay. Um, how close are we to the surface? Oh, we are really close. Okay. Need to slow down a little bit. Oh boy, this is nerve wracking. Uh, yeah, we need to uh slow down. Okay. We're getting very close. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, we are so close. Yeah. We need to slow down. Please. Please, slow down. We are almost out of fuel. Oh. The moon surface was closer than I expected. But you know, it's okay. We're okay, everyone's okay. We lost our main engine, but every everything is fine. Oh. Okay. that kind of uh kind of stranded us here we're gonna need a rescue mission just to save the guys who went to the moon but you know what at the moment we're going to Appreciate what we've done. Come on, Jeb. Plant that flag. Yeah. Uh... What should the site name be? Let's see. <laughs> uh, how did this mission Miss on. <laughs> Miss on, even. How did this mission... 
suck seed. And plant text. Uh, ka boom. Yeah. We did it, Jab. We landed on the moon. Oh, okay. We landed on the moon. We actually did it. <laughs> Jeb's having fun. Anyway. Next time. I think we're going to try to send out another mission. To maybe rescue this one. Okay. Uh. Uh, grab and board. And maybe next time we'll even, with that rescue mission, start a moon base. So, anyway, I'm glad you guys could join me, and I'll see y'all next time.